All right, this here is uh, this a mess right now <laughs> with my camera anyway. Okay, what I'm doing here is uh, I've got my little bucket sluice concentrator, as it's called by California Sluice Box, and I just thought I'd uh, get it running here. Very difficult getting it to stay on the end because of the this this tray is so light. This tray is so light that when you put the hose on it, I mean it just wants to pull it right up. And so if you don't get the if you don't get the uh, the uh, what you call it, cable down here with the the ends on, man. I'll tell you, my brain is just really going. You know the uh, the cables with the <laughs> the stretchy cables with the uh, curved ends on them to hook them on things. J uh, jumper braids. Ah, uh, just I can't think of the name. Well, anyway. Yeah, you gotta secure them on there pretty good, or it's it's gonna go flying. I I've thought about drilling a couple of holes in the plastic of the bucket to actually put them through so that they hook and stay. Cause boy, they can move awfully easily. And it's running into a bucket, and uh, uh, I've put some through, some concentrates through the thirty, uh, the. Uh, 30 minus and uh, I'm going to continue putting them through and see what we can find in here these are concentrates that have gone through both Tom and Jerry's uh, Tom and Perry's uh, gutter sluice and uh, my blue bowl so who knows what's going to come up with this all right I'll come back to you later. positive thing about this uh, is that you can actually feed it pretty fast it uh, doesn't doesn't take uh, a whole lot of time to push that stuff down. Now it's built up down here at the end because my bucket is full of water. I think if I scoop some of that water out, I'll uh, I'll be able to uh, see better what's going on. So okay, okay, I've uh, brought the stuff in to my patio where I do most of my stuff here, and uh, I've drilled a couple of holes in the bucket to uh, facilitate keeping these babies in there so they won't slip off when I put the hose on. Now I've got my recycling situation set up here. I got my my pond pump down in there uh, and I'll hook it up to the end of the sluice and uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, we'll go from there. All right, uh, talk to you in a bit. I forgot to mention I drilled holes in the side of the bucket to, if you can see them down here, to let it drain out into the, back into the pump area. I don't expect to get uh, any concentrates higher than that <laughs> where it'll go back in with the pump. So, uh, if the camera's shaking, it's because I'm going through a little hypoglycemia to act here with my diabetes so let's uh, turn this off for a bit all right so I'm back with, uh, I've got my pond pump hooked up and it's running down the sluice I've, uh, I've put some material through there uh, seems to be working pretty good the water's going into the bucket the uh, sand's going into the bucket and I've got three holes down here where the water's coming out in the bucket and most of the sand going in the bucket so okay we're going to keep this operation going here and uh, report on it a little bit 